So Hewlett Packard just acquired Juniper Network. And I found this out just this morning, July the 2nd, 2025, in my email inbox. I'm no different. Sure, many customers got this, but I had no idea, no clue, no fruition that this was coming. And this is a note from the former CEO of Juniper. We see down here, we'll skip ahead to the signature block. President and GM of HPE Networking, former CEO of Juniper. So this is official. This is not a merger. This is an acquisition. Um, so I know just like many of you, this letter here, again, special thanks and kind of saying what's ahead. You know, you got to give the pros to kudos, et cetera. Um, and then ending it with thank you for being a part of this journey. I mean, in the networking field, been around long enough. We remember Brocade, of course, uh, different things, Splunk being purchased recently by Cisco. Just a lot of these uh, larger companies, these conglomerates that, of course, procure uh, different vendors and their technologies. Of course, Juniper and, of course, that miss the AI wireless is one of those big things that, you know, they're kind of leading or on the bleeding edge within the industry, but haven't Googled this or anything to see what else is out there. Definitely going to do this right after this video, but just wanted to really come out here and say, wow, I mean, this, this is a little bit crazy, but that's the future in this unparalleled universe and global economy that we live in. I know folks are wondering what happens with my certs and what does this mean with the branding? Will the name change on, you know, equipment and gear, firewalls? etc you know but that remains to be seen you know will hpe's current portfolio adopt the os that underlines june os um, which is pretty sweet you know you can take a router and uh, with this few simple commands you know upgrade it to a firewall um, and you know that that different schema that's more xml like that a lot of us have become familiar with there's just a lot of things that i'm wondering and it remains to be seen to the stakeholders uh, we'll definitely be on the lookout and have our ears open to see uh, what this is going to really bring in the coming weeks and months ahead. I'm sure it may be slow that that existing portfolio will remain supported um, out there. Vendors that are locked in, you don't want to just log in one day and say, you know, what's up? You know, am I getting ready to lose the capability of all of this existing, especially with the federal government being uh, one of the number one and primary customers of you know, Juniper, but exciting news here today. Just thought I'd quickly share. Like I said, I got a lot of more research to do, but you know, I'm just one among many. You see, 22 minutes ago, just got this this morning. Um, but let me know your thoughts down below. Like, what's the number one concern or what's fascinating you or what do you really think will come of this acquisition? Like I said, I'll start to gather my thoughts um, because, like I said, wow, this one's just hitting me right now. But um, definitely, definitely, definitely. Looking forward to this one. But thank each and every one of you again for always rocking and here with me. And until next time, stay safe, take care of yourselves, and peace.